gonna send you a few uh, little videos and you might be interested in them, you might not, you can throw them away if you want. But anyway, just showing you the battery build. I've started on it already. This is a uh, part of it's already done here. You can see uh, I have one, two, three, four groups tied together that were, and I'll show you how I started doing this. I start with a piece of regular number 12 wire and I set it right down this trough right here. I'm gonna actually dig the trough out with a little grinder. I grind the, the notches a little bit so it gets a little bit uh, deeper in there so there's less uh, depth on the on the battery in, in product and then once I, I get that all set then I bring it over to here and this is my test jig for um, the pre-soldering I don't want to do I want to do as little soldering on the battery as possible so I pre-solder all the jumpers on here the little T's I think you can see this uh, from the video maybe it turn just a little bit here and I, I started all these T's, all eight of them, down the, the row here and get them all pre-soldered to then go on here. I then pre-solder all the, the um, battery leads and then I bring that over to it and melt it, uh, solder them together. With this soldering iron, I can get a, really, a, pretty good com uh, a pretty good connection, but I always go over the negative sides with my big soldering iron. I'll show you that in the end because they, they, these soak up so much more heat, you need a bigger soldering iron to do the final touch-up to make sure you have a really good contact in all of them. So that ends up with uh, having, these links are one millimeter uh, uh, copper pipe uh, wire, which um, are probably good for about 80 to 100, uh, to 100 amps. And if one cell were to short, all 200, 300 amps would possibly go through there if it was left to be a big bar. But the fact that it's a, a fusible link, it will blow and that'll keep the rest of the cells in that group, they'll be okay. It'll just drop that one out of the circuit. So that's why I've gone to this method of uh, building the batteries. And so I'll stop here. I'll show you a little bit next step.